ready to see that Star Ocean opening? I am. <laughs> Let's get it. We're not even going to start with the extra fluff. We're just going to go into this shit, my good friends. We got a full-on opening movie that we need to freaking take a look at. So let's get into this shit. Yes. Give it to me, Dry Ace. Give me the goods. Development footage. Subject this to change. Ocean of stars. Who first gazed up at it? Oh. Dreamt that it held the key we to got Elena's future. As How the narrator. The universe must have seemed to them. Unending and eternal, filled with infinite possibility. Mm hmm. But if only those dreamers knew what I know now that humankind harbors a voracious hunger, one not even the limitless cosmos can sate. A uh hole. -huh. Is that so? Quite the narration. I'm sorry, but Elena is bae. Uh, another 24 hours and we're off the clock. Gotta say, this has been one easy gig. Yes, I suppose it has. Would you care for more coffee, Ray? Sure. I could see that she's the more level-headed uh, one. Captain, seriously, something's up today. I can feel it. Your sixth sense again. I'll take your word for it. Human's intuition is a mystery to me. Oh. Hey, danger so she's not a human. When you least expect it. Maybe pirates are sneaking up on us as we speak. Oh, ha, ha. The what way on how she guy? acts is expressionless. Um, <laughs> expression. For real, though. Emotionless. Gotta relax. Really? Look out emotionless. Out. Thank you. This is what you get for ignoring me. Probably just some random asteroid field or something. Oh? Huh? Scanning craft. Verified. Pangalactic Federation battleship, the Astoria. As in their latest and greatest. I heard it also has a Kenny on board. What's it doing so far outside of Fed space? I think they're aiming at us. Warning. Phase cannon fired. Distance 350,000 clicks. Take evasive action. Starboard thrusters to full power. There's no time. Everyone brace for impact. Oh, shit. <clears throat> Damn! Shields holding at 78%. What are Hatch we doing a signal with this? Tell them we're not hostiles, damn it! No response. Second strike incoming. Oh. Oh, fuck. Away! Proton torpedoes? Get schematics on screen. Find us a way out of here now! No good. Cannons fired at our projected course. This is what we saw in the uh, trailer. Weapons activity detected. Readying third strike. Still no response from the Astoria. It seems they have no intention of letting us go. Oh shit. Fucking full on, like, Star Wars Empire. Ceased fire. Your orders. Abandon ship. All crew members, get to an escape pod. Wait. We must consider the cargo. Is evacuating the correct course of action? These are feds we're dealing with here. We don't clear out now. We're goddamn space dust. This job isn't worth our lives. Captain's orders. Evacuate immediately. The actual limp sync, um, lip sync needs a little bit of some work. But that's kind of typical when it comes to Star Ocean games. Send it, Don't worry. I'll be right behind you. I'll be fine. Uh, 
I feel like in the long run, when I play this game, I'm most likely gonna do like two gameplay playthroughs. I'll play Raymond first and then play uh, Leticia. No matter how hard you try, you won't be able to open that door. Elena? The Astoria has fired on us. I'm sorry, but there's not enough time to save the cargo before impact. You have one minute. That's more than enough time. Now help! Yes, Captain. No, hey, stop! What do you think you're doing? Elena! Oh shit. The crew of the Edis needs you. Good luck, Ray. And goodbye. Oh no! shit. We know that she lives, technically speaking. I mean, considering that she's apparently not human, she could probably I don't know. I'm only assuming that she's most likely Computer. Some kind of cyborg Number or something. Number location of all ejected pots. According or just a robot. Record, nine of the 49 escape pots have been successfully jettisoned and are now untraceable. Damn. This ocean of stars. Who first gazed up at it? Dreamt that it held the key to humanity's future. Deep. How vast the universe must have seemed to them. Unending and eternal, filled with infinite possibility. Setting course, fourth planet of the Aster star system, warp 2.1. Estimated arrival, five days. An Damn. Planet? I can't take this. <laughs> Humanity is insatiable. That's that that sounds like someone that's like literally going to a place where you can't even use a cell phone. <laughs> no devices for you. That's gotta be Chloe. Open up a channel. Ray? Oh thank goodness. Is Elena okay? It is you. Man, I'm glad to hear your voice. Elena, she She's safe. So let's you and me worry about our own hides. Huh? How does he know that, though? Planet, Ray. Relax. People back home probably just got our Mayday call. They're coming. So until they get here, just think of this as an adventure, okay? Entering orbit around the fourth planet in the Aster star system. Bruh, I am already so sucked into this. Dude, I'm already so sucked into this and I'm not playing the game. Ah! <laughs> the hell? Chloe, hey, answer me. Shoot. Just hold on. I'm coming, okay? Oh my god, dude. I am so fucking into this I, I i i need this i need this game i need this story it's gonna tie me over until freaking 16 dude oh my god that was so good uh, i got sucked into that story completely brah and that was just the opening movie for raymond And I have to wait. I have to wait until October. <laughs> it's literally four months away. Four months away. Four months away. My God. I just cannot. So, even though Elena is not technically a human, she's still Bay, though. It's not changing. <laughs> as far as that, my good friends, I don't really have anything else to really say. All I know is that I just want this game and I am so neck deep into the story. I need like 
I need this game just so I can experience a new Star Ocean, please. It's been so damn long for what it feels like for me, honestly. And the thing is, is that I don't really think that it was really all that long ago since Fa um, Integrity and Faithlessness actually came out. Now that I think about it, but still, it doesn't even matter. I just want this game. With that in mind, my good friends, that is it for the time being. There's still more there is to come. Got a little bit of some experimentation I want to work on and so on and so forth. So I essentially got some plans for you. Don't exactly have any actual time frame of which I will be like showing what it is that I'm planning, but it's something nonetheless. But with that, I hope you guys have a very nice day, nice night, nice morning, nice afternoon, all that good nonsense, and I shall catch you in the next one. Deuces. <laughs>